Good afternoon, everyone. It is my pleasure to be here, have this presentation, and introduce our company. I'm from The Gap, which is one of the most competitive manufacturers in the garment industry. And my name is Amber. This is our, and today our presentation can be divided into three parts. First of all, we will have a short introduction about our company. Then we will present our stark performance in recent years. Last but not least, we will focus on our financial operations. We have six brands on the market in nowadays. There are Gap, Banana Republic, Old Navy, Piper Lime, Athleta, and Intermix. We offer a range of products that include apparel, accessories, and also some personal care products for men, women, and children under our six brands. Our company was founded in 1969 in San Francisco, and then in 1987, we started operating our stores in other countries. So nowadays, you can find our stores in many countries such as America, Europe, Asia, and also Africa. And also, our, uh, and also we have some franchise agreements with um, affiliated franchises in many countries to operate our GAPE, Banana Republic, and Old Navies. Additionally, up to today, we have a total of 140,000 employees in our company. And these are our four key priorities, that is global growth, product, experience, and talent. And in the next section, that's welcome my colleague, Sarah. Good afternoon everyone and I'm here to talk to you about our stock performance and financial operations. Now as everyone knows the principal market on which our stock is traded is the New York Stock Exchange and as of March 17, 2015 the total number of stockholders for the gap is 7,264. Now this, ta this table talks about market prices div and dividends declared and paid for each of the fiscal quarters in the year 2013 and 2014. Now, if you look at the year 2013, the highest that our stock has been sold for is $46.56, whereas the lowest is $31.19. Now, if you look at 2014, we can see that there has been an increase and we are evolving slowly and doing better. If you look, the lowest is only $37 and the highest is $46.85. Now, the table next to you, you, in the table next to you, you can see the dividends declared and paid for the two fiscal years. If you look at 2013, the total comes to $0.70, whereas in 2014, there has been a marked increase of $0.18, so our total is $0.88. In the next portion, I am going to talk to you about our stock performance graph. If you look at this portion, you can see that there has been an increase from the year 2010 to 2015. We are slowly growing and doing better. If you look at our graph, you can see that there is a stable growth, even though in more recent years, it is not as pronounced, but that is because of the economy. But we are still trying our best to grow and become a better company. Finally, I am going to talk to you about our financial report. If you look at the year 2014, we have showed an increase of $287 million or 2% as compared to the fiscal year 2013. It was partially offset by the fact that there was an in unfavorable impact due to foreign exchange of about $130 million. But this has mainly been because of a decrease in the foreign exchange currency price for the Japanese yen as well as the Canadian dollar. Next, the other reason for a decrease in the net is in the net sales at GAP. So that's why we haven't done as well as we hoped for, but that doesn't stop us from trying further. Uh, thank you so much for your attention, and I hope that this information is going to help you make a well-informed decision about whether you would like to invest with us. Should you decide to do so, I hope that we have a long and fulfilling relationship